to tell you the truth, I didn't think we could do it. Well, the truth, neither did I. Sunday is another entertaining night on Channel 7. Be sure to watch The Gambler, starring James Caan and Lauren Hutton, tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Sunday night, troubled children find a cause to believe in and a second chance for themselves. Billy Mummy stars in Bless the Beasts and Children, Sunday night at 11 on Channel 7. It is the continuing intention of WLS-TV to make available public service announcement time to responsible, non-profit community organizations for the purpose of publicizing events of general interest. If you'd like details, write to Public Service Department, WLS-TV, 190 North State, Chicago, 60601. Frank Lloyd Wright, the Guggenheim Museum in New York, designed by the world-famous architect at the age of 90. Grandma Moses, American artist who started painting at the age of 78, the great lady of American art. Louis Armstrong, ambassador musician who dominated the world of jazz for 40 years. Helen Hayes, received an Oscar for her performance in the film Airport, the first lady of the theater at 70. Eugene Ormandy. In a society such as ours, we sometimes forget that great accomplishments are not the privilege of the young. George Washington Carver, established a research foundation at... These are famous people, but each of us in his own way can make a contribution to life around us in our 60s or 70s. For ideas on active retirement, write the American Association of Retired Persons, AARP, Box TVW, Washington, D.C., 20006. Strengthen the chains of progress give to the United Negro College Fund. Good morning. Keep on keeping on. That means you. Keep on keeping on. I'd like to think about Luke, the seventh chapter and the 27th verse. And this passage of scripture reads as follows. Behold, I send my messenger before thy face, which shall prepare thy way before thee. We shall keep on keeping on. As we plant the seeds of new ideas, of progressive attainment, as we begin to push growth upward, each day we ought to desire to be more successful and more peaceful and more understanding about our loved ones and others all around us in the world. We sustain the forward and upward growth. We weed out all of the negative and destructive ideas that would destroy a successful harvest. We treat ourselves to know that with diligence and a constant monitoring of our consciousness along avenues of progress, our desired goals will be attained because we know that we're going to keep on keeping on. Daily, we are inheritors of the ever-flowing intelligence of God and its unfolding wonders through us. At all times, we can widen our horizons and step forward with progressive ideas into successful attainment, recognizing that we are constantly being taught by the indwelling presence. We work toward successful endeavors to seek to do more, to have more, and to express more of our divine nature. Therefore, 
do this for me this day. Let's recognize that God is all-powerful and that we are one with His power, living in a consciousness of success and of accomplishment. Problems in human relationships and in our work are surmounted, and we're embarking upon a fresh avenue of enthusiasm by aligning our thoughts and ideas with the divine Noah within us. Remember these words as I conclude. The love of God surrounds you. The presence of God protects you. The power of God watches over you. Wherever you are, God is, God is, God is. This is WLS-TV, Channel 7, Chicago's first television station, transmitting on circular polarization from atop the Sears Tower. WLS-TV, now serving 8.5 million Chicago area residents, is a member in good standing of the National Association of Broadcasters and subscribes to the NAB Television Code of Good Practices. The time is now 2.42 as we leave the air. We invite you to tune in again tomorrow for the finest in television programming. Good night. This is WIK 22 and WBE 787.